So I remember the other day when uh, I noticed my tire was going flat. Ended up biting me right in the ass. That's definitely a flat tire. Kind of sucks that I have to use a tow just to take it like literally not even a mile away to a tire shop. But there's no way I'd drive it on the destroyed tire. It was already about to cut through to the rim. Yeah, what can you do? So I'm gonna get this taken care of and then after that, go try and have some fun on my bike. Number one key in life, learn how to smile through the bullshit. That's what happens if you're getting a flat and you don't take care of it quick enough. You just shred your entire tire and then you have to pay a lot of money. Don't be like me. If you're getting a flat, take care of it quick, get it patched, or do something about it. Otherwise, you're gonna be screwed. So I was sitting here waiting for my tire to get fixed and a fan randomly drives past and I look at him and he's giving me this weird look and then he keeps going, but then he reverses and he's like, hey, do you have stickers? Oh yeah. Here you go, bro. That's I was like, who's this dude reversing? Oh shit, you got a nice bike. Yeah. That's what's up, bro. What's your name? I'm Oscar. Pleasure, bro. Right, Take it easy. Right. Love it. Fan love all over the place. Shout out to Oscar. Tire's fixed. Uh, next on the agenda? I don't know. Let's see what happens. Shout out to Super Less for having these really long pipes that extend to the other side because I parked the wrong way. I spent the last hour and a half driving from West LA to get to Long Beach. To meet up with Markel to go have a session at that DIY spot that we had a jam at a couple weeks ago. The sun's setting, I think we're gonna barely catch the last little bit of it. One crazy idea I've had, like conceptually for a video or just to implement into my vlog series in my life basically, is to sell my car and just start taking Uber everywhere. If I take Uber everywhere, I can get stuff done all the time. I can be shooting, and then the second I'm done shooting, on the way to the next shoot, I can have my laptop in my bag and be editing. I just want to get more stuff done, you know, and having to drive in traffic for two to three hours a day really cuts down on my ability to do that. So comment below if you think I should sell my car and start taking Uber everywhere. Not a scooter. All right, finally made it to Long Beach. Real quick, in case you missed it in the other video two days ago, Saturday, all day, I'm going to be in Charlotte, North Carolina with Xavier Wolf. So if you're there or in the area, come to Tuner Evo. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Xavier's gonna perform. I'm gonna be filming stuff all day. I don't know what, but I'll be there. So come through. All right, let's go. I see a backpack, but no Markel. There he is. Ha <laughs> ha, getting a fresh boy warm up. Yo. Ah, he's making his return, finally. Finally back in the game, yeah. finally back in the vlogs. Right on time, shout out to yep. the best film in the game too. All right, gonna get a drone flight before the sun is completely down, cause it's pretty much already down. And then I'm gonna get some warm ups and get some clips. Let's do this. All right, we're all here warming up. I would have Chris film this, but we're like totally still warming up. I'm gonna try quick. Oh, my mic fell off. Mic fell right off the camera. I'm gonna do a couple warm up clips. Simple stuff. Ice pick doesn't work on this weird square ledge. Maybe that's our tires bar. <laughs> Couple clips down. Calling you out, you called me out, so I'm calling you out in reverse. Uh, People threw that. But I'm sick. Hey, hey he came. I just woke up. Tell him that he came, he's still here. You here, you on a bike. Uh, I don't see no sick. flat tires. Hold up, I got you up. Let's see that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sorry, still solo, flat, 
non-moving static angles. Okay, Jordan. Who got that first try? Why are you pretending like you wasn't gonna do a first try? I did it. All right, where you at? What you got? I'm gonna just try to do Smith 180 on the rail. Dang. Okay. Oh, all right, film is about to get real. Going to the fish eye right now. Yo, yo. <laughs> Markel evades death. Nice exit. Scared of what? Scared of what? Markel's not scared of anything. Yo. Hey, you have the craziest Smith 180 style where you like spin the front, then the back. Yo. Yo. Where's your stickers at? <laughs> oh, I got some clear ones. Oh, come on. Yo. Why is he not Smith, keeping Smith. his foot on? Ah, <laughs> to the ice. <laughs> Yo. That was fire, huh? That was fire, low key. Hey, that was on purpose. <laughs> oh, come on. There it is. Yes, 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 yes. Ouch. Two. Uh, two? Oh my god. Of course. Oh. This. Hey, the clip is clean, though. Thank you. We gotta get this kid a bike sponsor. Two spokes. Wanna help me get a line? Yeah. Okay. Here. 180, Becky bar, and then 180. Put a comment below if you want to see the 180 bar how-to. I don't really do a lot of how-tos, but I've been thinking about doing that one recently. Lots of people have been asking. Do a how-to. If you want to see the 180 bar how-to, comments. All right. <laughs> oh, the Indian. <laughs> oh, <next>. <laughs> <laughs> Follow Chris underscore the Mexican. Once again, his channel will be linked in the description. Get this man some followers. Let's get him to 500 on this video. Comment if you want to see the Chris clip. Very hashtag Chris clip in the comments. Let's see that. Let's make this happen. Maybe not this video, but we'll get him to do something. Ah, the correction hop. <laughs> Need to like not make it hideous. What are you doing? Uh, you are high. What are you doing? <laughs> Alright, come on, jump. Let's go. <laughs> FBI, who is this man? Who is this nigga? Oh yeah, I'm Markel Jones. Who is oh, this man. nigga? <laughs> Get down. Hey, now you're stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for filming like a boss once again. Oh, yeah. Follow that dude. Whoa. This is sick. Get some more crank clip clips soon. Yeah. Good job on that table three. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Hold. He's tight. Good looking. Be safe, homies. That sesh is a wrap. I got the one clip, even though it didn't turn out great. Still better than not getting the clip. I'm in Long Beach. I don't know what I'm gonna do next. I'm definitely gonna go do Q and A's, but I'm gonna do that tomorrow morning, right before I upload this video. Uh, not Q and A, but respond to comments like I've been doing. Instead of five, I'm gonna do three this time, keep it a little bit shorter. Yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do next. I might ride somewhere else. I might just go chill. I'm in Long Beach. I don't wanna drive all the way home yet. You ready to do this? You ride your bike with your camera? All the time. Come on, let's really? get you on this bike. Let's go. What am I doing? Uh, do I sit on it or do I not sit on it? <laughs> Whatever feels comfortable. Killing it. Kind of. Kind of? Hold on, we'll figure it out in a second. All right, I uh, finished the session with Markel. 
They went to go ride Houghton. I wasn't into going to the skate park, so I met up with my friend Miriam, who I haven't seen in forever. She just moved to Long Beach. I've been meaning to hang out with her. So I figured I'd get her on my bike and teach her how to do a bunny hop. Let's see this. <laughs> you're going kind of fast. No helmets here, no brakes, no nothing. And you're on a free coaster, so... How do I brake? You just stop. Like, you just, you just stop. All right, we're going to have to force you to do a bunny hop. How? I mean, How am I gonna do, do you have any concept? Is it while I'm going, or...? Exactly. So you're going to, like, go, and then you're going to pull up, and then you're going to jump with your legs oh at the God. same time. Do all that stuff. Yeah, like now. <laughs> Do it like over here so I can see better. Go. Yo, okay, that's a start. So like jump with your legs, if that makes sense. Oh, okay, like you're somewhere. I love how confident you are. You just got on the bike and started going. Uh, you're kind of getting somewhere, but not really. Oh, there you go, kind of. Okay, do that again, but like with more force. Yes. That was not bad. That was a solid first effort. <laughs> BMX is a sport, is it? I feel like I rode for Yes, like seven that's miles. good. Endurance. You got to get your endurance up. You're pretty I, close. Let me see you do it. I need a demonstration. <laughs> you need the demonstration? All right. You're doing the arms, but you weren't doing the legs. You need to do everything at the same time. Go. So like... Envision the bunny hop and you will make it happen. You're like close, but not really close. You're not really committed. Hold my phone. Oh yeah, it's getting real. Let me hold the phone. Anything else? Anything you got to get out of your pockets? Anything. Oh, my mom, I love her. Okay. <laughs> to be fair, odds of her learning how to bunny hop out of never trying one before right now, kind of low, but I mean, it's worth a shot. <laughs> oh, oh, that was almost the back wheel up. Almost. No. Oh. <laughs> Both legs level. Keep your feet level. Like that? Yeah, perfect. And then arms first and then legs. Oh, oh, yo. <laughs> Nah, they're there. You just need to like put everything together in one motion. Yo, okay, kind of. You're like, you're getting somewhere. You're making progress. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, you're like kind of there. You're sort of doing a bunny hop. Oh, yo, if you, okay, do the same thing you're doing, but with way more force. Just like, uh. <laughs> That's the girls who want to try and bunny hop. If you're a girl watching this and you want to learn bunny hop, hopefully this will inspire you. Ugh. See, now you're going back to square one. You need to also think about the legs at all times. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. you got this. Take a breather. All right. Let me see you do it again. <laughs> okay. I was kind of joking. I was totally joking, actually, when I told her that we're going to teach her how to bunny hop, but she's actually going for it. So you are... Let... What? <laughs> what you got to say? <laughs> no, it's cool. yeah, I was kind of joking, not going to lie, but she's actually almost there. Let me see. Is this info? <laughs> yeah, man, I'm not nervous. I'm probably not even in this shot. This, you're back to doing this. You're like pulling hard, but you're not doing it with the legs. This, you're back to doing this. You're like pulling hard, but you're not doing it with the legs. Think of it as an actual physical jump, like you jump. Why can't I do it? <laughs> you're close. That's the thing. You are close. You are really close. She's not that close. You ain't breaking a sweat yet. I'll make you break a sweat. Okay. 10% anger. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, put your anger into it. Make it like, that's what happens when you think about it too much. You just don't do nothing. It's just fun to ride. Yeah, okay. Or you can just go ride around. Just go ride around the parking lot. Free your mind a little bit. Sit in yourself, but it's just not happening. It's just not, it's, I don't think it's going to happen tonight. Oh, no, you're good. I got you. Level your pedals. Like, make your feet even. Yeah, this is where you want to be, like when you're about to bunny hop. You want to have your feet totally even like that. Do I that. have to be like kind of low? Because I feel like I've been pretty high for two and a half. Give it a couple more goes. I'm going to try it Give it a couple more. Let's see this. Who knows? Maybe we'll see our bunny hop. Yeah. Okay, do it as like a motion as opposed to like starting low and then hopping. Start high and then compress and then, hey. Uh-huh. People, comment below if I should like start a female BMX training program where I just teach girls how to bunny hop. If you want to see me teaching more girls how to bunny hop, leave a comment because who knows, maybe we could be honest something here. Dylan, do you feel like you know how to bunny hop? In my head, yeah. Yes. In real life. That's mm. step one. You need to believe. That was fun. Was it? That was hella fun. I'm sad. All right, she's going to give up for tonight, but if you want to see me actually teach Miriam how to bunny hop, maybe in another video, leave a comment. Maybe we can make it happen. I'm going to learn. 
She wants to learn. What do you got to say to the people out there? That was hard. A lot harder <laughs> than, than it looked. <laughs> I thought it'd be easy. I'm like, mm, I'm going to do it. First try. First try. That's First some try. cockiness. I love it. Maybe next time. Question time. First comment is from Kevin Fletcher. A little late, but I agree what you say about photography. This is the episode where I say don't go to film school. That. You see that slobber? He says, how do you approach companies besides just showing them your work? How do you like initially open the door and even make contact with them? Basically, my advice for that, even though it sounds surprising and like it may not really... Oh, it's so windy. Hold on, let me get through here. All right, even though it might not totally seem like it makes sense, the best way to even initially like get noticed by these companies who then you will show your work to to get the job is by being out and shooting all the time. If you're in your house not shooting, there's virtually no way for you to get noticed by shooting. Like you need to be outside and working. That's pretty much the only way you're gonna make progress. Other than that, like the best advice I could give is like get on Craigslist, cold call, email everybody who's like putting out classified ads for videographers, stuff like that. Like put yourself out there as much as possible. Ask friends, ask family if they need anything like photo shot up, start working for free. You just need to get noticed and then your name will get spread around basically. That's how you start. My right, second comment is from Peach Life. He's saying that uh, he like, he's been doing YouTube for a few months and it's just not going as planned. Honestly, YouTube is really hard for everyone, especially at the beginning. You just need to continue working every day. You need to find your niche. You need to plug away every single day. Don't let anything deter you from working. You need to like, even when no one's watching, even when all the comments are purely negative, even if like nobody cares, you need to keep going. You cannot stop for any reason, even if it feels like you're doing it for no reason. You gotta continue, bro, honestly. That's the only way you're really gonna like make some headway is if you do it every day, every single day, no excuses. As in like, you get off your job and then you talk to your camera for an hour or whatever and then chop it up. Like, you just need to do something towards it every single day, every day. Okay, last comment is from Louis M8. And he says, you know, it's kind of sad that uh, I spend all my time filming other people and no one wants to film me. To be honest, I get it. Filming sucks. It's not fun to do. Nobody really wants to do it. Anytime like someone does it for me, I consider it like a huge favor. It's something that I want to do, but that's an intrinsic motivation for me. I like, to, I like doing it. I enjoy doing it. I can't expect that from everyone else. So obviously I'm not going to get mad when nobody wants to film. I'm happy to set it up on a tripod, put it on the ground. Half the time I ask someone to film, they kind of screw it up anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. All right, I kept it quick this time. I went from five questions down to three because I want to tighten this up. Oh! If you ever run a booster board, you know you can't go through water at all. But yeah, I went from five questions to three just to keep this segment a little bit tighter. I want to just don't want to just keep talking for like ever. But if you enjoy these, leave a comment. Let me know if you enjoy when I respond to comments. I really enjoy doing it. I might do it more often. Right now I'm doing it like once a week. Maybe I'll do it twice a week. I don't want to bore you guys though. Um, but yeah, leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know your opinions. As always, I love reading what you guys have to say. So say some things. Check out hicksfilm.com and stay tuned for tomorrow's upload. Thank you guys for watching another John Hicks film. Peace. Right here. No, like right. <laughs> It's gonna be awesome, don't worry, you're gonna be on YouTube. <laughs> Hold it like right here. I'm just gonna do a bar scene right there. Okay. Okay. Good. It's my fan club. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just search me on YouTube, John Higgs. Give him the patch kit. The patch kit has Instagram. <laughs> I'll put it in. <laughs> Quit riding, go to filming. There it is.